Hello students, welcome to Soil Cells classes. In this video, I will be solving some of the questions of geology from JAM 2018. Now, in the first question, we have to say which of the following is the orientation, is the correct orientation of the fold axis and axial plane as given in this figure. Now, the correct answer of this question is option number A, that is reclined fold, which is a sideways closing fold sideways closing fold closing fold whose hinge line whose hinge line is parallel is parallel to the direction of depth of the axial plane to the direction of depth of the axial plane. So the correct answer of this question is option number A that is reclined fold. Now in the next question we have this image which is uh, which shows the morphological features corresponding to an echinoid. And we have to show this, they are numbered as 1 to 4 and we have to show which of the following is correct, um, correct uh, numbering of these or correct naming of these four points that is 1 to 4. Now, this echinoids, they have, they have 5 interambulacral columns interambulacral columns columns and five ambulacral columns ambulacral columns which are pierced by single or double pores of tube feet so which are pierced by single or so they are pierced by single or double pores for the tube feet double pores for tube feet So, this option number 2, that is this part, it is ambulacra and this third one, it is interambulacra. So, second one is ambulacra and the third one is interambulacra. Now, these echinoids, they have two openings. The first one is periproct and the next one is peristome. Now, here the peristome is the oval D-shaped opening on the lower surface where the mouth is situated. So, this four, it is the peristome. Peristome. That is the oval D shaped, oval to D shaped, oval to D shaped opening on the lower surface, opening on the lower surface where mouth is situated mouth is situated and number one it is periproct which is which is always positioned towards the posterior and they house anal opening so this periproct 
they are always positioned towards positioned towards the posterior and they houses anal opening they houses anal opening so one is periprox two is ambulacra third one is interambulacra and fourth one is peristome which is our option number one so the correct answer of question number 16 is option number one now in the next question we have to find which one of the following is the correct order of marine benthic habitats with increasing water depth so the correct answer of this question is option number c as as this neritic zone it extends from the high tide mark high tide mark to the edge of continental shelf to the edge of continental shelf continental shelf next is beth hill which extends from the bottom of euphotic zone that is the zone in which the sunlight penetrates to the depth of about one h double zero meters so it extends from it extends from the bottom of euphotic zone that is the zone in which sunlight penetrates sunlight penetrates so it is from the bottom of euphotic zone to the depth of about 1800 meters to the depth of about 1800 meters and the next one that is abyssal abyssal zone it is from the bottom of or it is below bathyal zone so this abyssal zone this is below bathyal zone so the correct order is neritic bathyal and abyssal so the correct answer is our option number c now let's move to the next question which is which one of the following invertebrates have most primitive visual system the correct answer of this question is option number d that is trilobites these trilobites even though they are not the first animals with eyes they have are the first one to develop to develop a sophisticated visual system in the animal kingdom so they have developed developed one of the first sophisticated sophisticated visual system visual system in animal kingdom animal kingdom and the majority of these trilobites they will they have a pair of compound eyes so they have a pair of compound eyes compound eyes that are made up with many lensed units so 
In the following invertebrates, trilobites have the most primitive visual system and as these trilobites, they have developed one of the first sophisticated visual systems in animal kingdom and most of them have pair of compound eyes which are made up of many lensed units.